This is Aflasafe, an award-winning all-natural product that effectively and dramatically reduces aflatoxin by between 80 and 100 percent in some of our staple foods in Africa. Aflatoxin is a highly toxic cancer-causing poison that contaminates human and animal food. Aflatoxin poisoning reaches even the unborn child in the womb because aflatoxin is systemic. Once it is in the body, it is also transmitted through breast milk and cow milk. Aflatoxin causes liver cancer, among other harmful health effects, and in some cases, kills. Aflatoxin greatly hampers trade, particularly for Africa. The Aflasafe journey begins in 2003 at the International Institute of Tropical Agriculture, IITA, headquartered in Nigeria. IITA plant pathologists began research on how to control this deadly poison. This research was in collaboration with the United States Department of Agriculture, USDA, and the universities of Bonn and Ibadan, with funding from the German government. The intensive and painstaking research resulted in Aflasafe, which was next tested in farmers' fields across Nigeria over several years. This two-step process would be used across several other countries, that is, product development in collaboration with USDA and country partners. followed by field testing in farmers' fields. The two-step process was bolstered by training and sensitization workshops for national biopesticide regulators and in-country Aflasafe champions. Twenty fourteen was a landmark when Aflasafe left the lab for bigger prospects with the completion of the first ever Aflasafe factory on African soil, built at IITA headquarters. With this factory, product development and testing for other countries intensified. logically followed by registration with relevant regulatory authorities in each country. Next was making Aflasafe available to even more farmers, starting in 2013 with an incentive-based pilot, the AgResults Nigeria Aflasafe Challenge Project. In 2016, IITA founded the Business Incubation Platform, which houses the Aflasafe Technology Transfer and Commercialization Initiative, ATTC, that also started in 2016. ATTC has a singular target, to cover half a million smallholder hectares with Aflasafe within five years in 11 African countries. To meet this target, ATTC follows five steps in each target country. 1. Drafting an Aflasafe commercialization strategy 2. Convening an investors forum to mobilize participation by the private sector, government and other development partners 3. Selecting investors after due diligence and through an open and competitive process 4. Signing of Technology Transfer and Licensing Agreement TTLA. And 5. Business Plan Implementation by Licensee to take Aflasafe to market. Product registration continues alongside. And thus far, licensing agreements have been signed for Senegal and the Gambia with Bamtare Services in 2017 with Harvest Field Industries Limited in Nigeria in 2018 and with A to Z Textile Mills Limited for Tanzania in 2019. 
2019 is proving to be a particularly momentous year in AfloSafe's commercialization journey, and the story is still being written. Bamtare completed the first ever private sector AfloSafe factory in Africa, with the first products for both Senegal and the Gambia rolling off the assembly lines in June 2019. In nearby Nigeria, Harvest Field is building an AfloSafe factory in Ogun State, while in East Africa, A to Z is constructing an AfloSafe factory at the Arusha headquarters. Kenya's ultra-modern donor-funded factory was commissioned in late 2019, production having begun in 2018. 2019 is also the year of the first ever Pan-African Conference for AfloSafe manufacturers and distributors in Arusha, Tanzania, in early November. They will report on their progress commercializing AfloSafe, exchange experiences, lessons learned and solutions found, learn about new developments in AfloSafe technology and production, and forge connections amongst themselves and with regulators, suppliers of manufacturing equipment and consumables, and aflatoxin conscious commodity buyers. Thus powered primarily by the private sector, AfloSafe is now on sale in six countries and counting, available in one and at various stages in product development in another dozen countries across Africa. From its humble beginnings in a lab in Nigeria in 2003, AfloSafe's reach today is 19 countries, of which 11 are targeted for rapid commercialization. Farmers continue to speak positively of AfloSafe and what it means for their health and income. <laughs> wanunue AfroSafe kwa apply kwa mahindi yao kwa sababu baada ya kufuna tukipeleka kwa board haitanunuliwa ikiwa na afrotoxin na ikikosa kununuliwa itakuwa hasara kwa wakulima wenzangu kwa sababu hiyo dio hawakashi crop ama hawa income with the AfroSafe KE01 I'm going to benefit because I'll have already market for my produce and of course at the same time i will make a maximum profit from my farm i started using this aflazer since 2014. a that is being farmed with aflazer ordinary we don't sell it to ordinary marketers it's these poultry farmers this big company that make next to food that come some came from port Aqua. just come and buy the yellow meal we produce from there why because of the quality of the maize. Ultimately, this contributes to the quality of life in Africa, saving Africans from deadly aflatoxin. AfloSafe, proudly made in Africa for Africa.